In this presentation, we will cover the basic anatomy of the 1500HD sound system, drivers, and amplifiers. The Sportsound 1500HD sound system is Dactronic's flagship standard outdoor sound system. Utilizing digital audio transport to deliver crystal clear speech, as well as powerful full range music, the 1500HD sound cabinet is the ideal choice sound system for a baseball field or mid-sized football soccer stadium of up to 8,000 seats from 20 yard line to end zone. The 1500HD is a standard point source sound system that can easily integrate with any video or scoreboard as well as stand proudly on its own. The 1500HD requires only one power circuit and accepts a flexible range of power which allows it to fit well in most mid-size outdoor sports venues, domestic or international. Keep in mind that this presentation covers the 1500HD sound system only. Audio control such as mixers, microphones, and CD players will not be covered in this presentation. Dectronics can provide several options for audio system control. If you are interested in learning more about them, please speak to one of our knowledgeable salespeople. The Sportsound 1500HD speaker cabinet is a high power, self-contained, point source speaker system which measures only 8 foot wide, 6 foot high, and 3.5 feet deep. Power and signal field connections are housed within an onboard control enclosure located just inside the right rear access door. The high mid frequency section has anywhere from 0 to 15 degrees of vertical adjustment in 2.5 degree increments. During installation, the high mid frequency section must be adjusted for optimal venue coverage and then locked into place. The rear view of the speaker cabinet shows the access doors for power signal enclosure connections, service of amplifiers, as well as service of the high and mid frequency speaker drivers. Access to adjustment of the high mid frequency section is gained through the rear access doors and rotating the high mid requires only a 9 16 inch wrench. High mid frequency section rotation is a crucial part of setting up the sound system and must be field adjusted during installation to properly cover the venue using drawing 913590. This slide is a production 1500 HD sound cabinet shown with the mesh removed for clarity. You can see each of the three speaker cabinets as well as the aluminum control enclosure tucked below the high frequency speaker. The 1500HD sound cabinet has only one configuration. The high mid frequency section rotation is the only adjustment that must be made. Service of high and mid frequency speaker drivers is provided through the rear access doors of the 1500HD cabinet. The drivers are easily accessed through removable rear access panels on each speaker. These panels are weather sealed with silicone and must be cut with a razor along the perimeter. They are fastened with 5 32nd inch hex machine screws and can be removed with an Allen wrench or a hex bit mounted on a drill driver. Replacement of the mid frequency driver requires a 3 16 inch hex bit or Allen wrench for the four machine bolts per driver. High frequency drivers are mounted with four threaded studs facing forward, fastened with 10 mm nuts. A ratcheting wrench will help make the job much easier. After replacing the driver, the panel must be replaced and the joint must be resealed with silicone. Sportsound 1500HD sound systems manufactured after April 2014 allow service of the low frequency drivers from the rear access door of the 1500HD cabinet. The drivers are easily accessed through removable rear access panels on each speaker. These panels are weather sealed with silicone and must be cut with a razor along the perimeter. They are fastened with 5 32nd inch hex machine screws and can be removed with an Allen wrench or a hex bit mounted on a drill driver. Replacing the low frequency driver requires removing the 8 machine screws with a 3 16 inch hex bit or Allen wrench. After replacing the driver, the panel must be replaced and the joint must be resealed with silicone. Sportsound 1500 HD sound systems manufactured prior to April of 2014 require service of the low frequency driver from the front. Access is achieved by removing the mesh frame from the 1500 HD cabinet. This requires a 9 16 inch socket to access the bolts that fasten the frame. The low frequency speaker cabinet grill must also be removed. This grill is weather sealed with silicone so it must first be cut with a razor along the perimeter and unscrewed using a number 2 Phillips screwdriver. Replacing the low frequency driver requires removing the 8 machine screws with a 3 16 inch hex bit or allen wrench. 
Using the hex bit mounted on the cordless drill driver will make this much easier. Replace the speaker grill and apply silicone to reseal the perimeter. Then replace the 1500 HD speaker cabinet mesh. Amplifier service is achieved through the rear access doors of the 1500 HD cabinet. Amplifiers are mounted with number two Phillips screws and are quickly removed with a cordless drill driver. All amplifier jacks are keyed so there is only one correct connection per cable. Each speaker cabinet, high, mid, and low, are considered a self-powered speaker, meaning the speaker has a built-in amplifier module. In the 1500 and 2000 HD, most amplifiers are two-channel modules. The amplifier's power is provided to the speakers via connection with a white 6-pin Molex connector with a pin-out on each amplifier as follows. Channel 1, lower right 2 positions, and channel 2, the left 2 positions. Schematic drawing 1082533 contains all 1500 HD wiring information. The control enclosure is an essential piece in all Dactronic standard audio systems, as this is the weather protective housing for all power and signal connections, as well as the fiber optic Ethernet switch. The control enclosure in the 1500 HD and 2000 HD systems slightly differ from the control enclosure in the 500 HD sound system. First, the control enclosure in the 1500 HD is smaller in size, so it is housed within the cabinet itself. Second, the 1500 HD control enclosure contains only power and signal connection points, whereas the 500 HD control enclosure contains amplifiers as well. The control enclosure is accessed via the rear access door located on the far right as viewed from the rear of the speaker cabinet. Accessing components and connections within the enclosure is as easy as a quarter turn of both latches done with either a flathead screwdriver or coin. The control enclosure is partitioned for low voltage signal components, the fiber conversion network switch, and audio isolation transformer, with a separated compartment for high voltage connections and power supply. Thank you for watching this presentation. If you have further questions about our products, please contact a Dactronics audio representative. Feel free to view our other videos and troubleshooting documents available at dactronics.com forward slash support, keyword support sound.